Hi everyone, uh, so this is what happens when you're left alone late at night. Um, I'm actually, well it's about, I haven't got a watch on, it's 11 o'clock-ish in Prague and I am waiting up till 1.50am to do a live appearance on Jimmy Kimmel, which I'm very excited about. I, I admire Jimmy a lot, uh, I find him very funny. Um, but I've, I've got to fill three hours, um, so I thought about something that Rafe Judkins, who is the showrunner of The Wheel of Time, told me casually in passing while we were on a Zoom the other day, that there is a way that you can open a pineapple without using a knife. So, apparently what I have to do is, I don't have very long nails, is get my thumb into this little kind of one, two, three, four, Hexagonal, look at that, hexagonal shaped area at the bottom of the pineapple. So I'm going to try and find an entry point. Oh, hang on, I'm in. <laughs> Feels faintly medical. Uh, um, okay, it's harder than it looks. Once you release this part, you are supposed to be able to... Um, Pull off bite-sized chunks, rather like the kind you find pre-packaged in fancy supermarkets, and apparently it comes out. They come out in perfect pineapple chunks. So the pineapple chunk is not, in fact, a human invention. The pineapple chunk is actually created by the pineapple itself. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I think I'm in. Ah, oh, I think I'm in. That is the amount of headway that I've made. Right, I've got. That's where my finger's gone in. I mean, as I say, I've got three hours, so it's all right. I'm trying not to say butt plug, but, you know, it's at the base of the fruit and it does seem to be a kind of plug. Well, I'm learning a lot about the anatomy of a pineapple. Pulled, oh dear. Oh dear. I've crushed, crushed the hairdo, but look, it springs up again. We have the plug nearly eradicated. I'm still working my way. Did you hear that? Did you hear that? <gasps> Look! The plug! <laughs> Wowza! Look at that! Wow! Kind of still a hexagon, isn't it? That is so cool. Now, what I'm supposed to be able to do is to take each of these little segments on the pineapple and pull them off. And apparently they will make beautiful, beautiful pineapple chunks. So, back to sitting comfortably and I'm going in. I guess some of them might be... Oh! Oh, will you look at that? Well, I should stay up late more often. This must be how writers feel when inspiration hits. In fact, this is probably how Ray feels all the time. Look at that, it's beautiful. Okay, oh. Mm. Will you look at that? I'm still dripping. Mm. Have you ever seen anything more beautiful? Like a sun or a constellation.